Do affirmations really work? Well, we're going to talk about the affirmation that existed before time was, the eternal affirmation of I am. This is Tom Kieran with the Be Something Wonderful studio of Higher Consciousness, where we help you level up and become the best version of yourself. Guys, welcome back. So the truth about uh, affirmations. Affirmations, like any other tool to manifest, the key that it, that it hinges on is that you believe it. But more than believing it, you gotta, you gotta feel it. So it's not just saying I believe it, it's actually feeling it. This is when the, when the thought and, and heart coalesce and join together, and that's when creation, that's when you create in that, in that metaphysical space. It's a joining of heart and mind. It's a joining of that, that, those elevate, higher elevated emotions with that thought and intention. But let's talk about I am. I am is your real self. That is God. That is your I am awareness. You are God. You are, God. You are part of that. And, and if you keep putting I am or thinking I am is outside of you, if God is outside of you, something else. If you don't believe that I am is God, and when you use those words, then you're limiting the, the greatest affirmation there ever was, is, or ever be. Right? God said to Moses, I am that I am. For all generations, that is my name forever and ever, right? So this is, this is the power of God or, the po or your power. It's unequaled. It's astonishing, right? It is, it is that access to all there is, was, or will ever be, right? So, so we're always using these words, but mostly unconsciously. And so we're creating unconsciously using these words. These I am's carry a lot of power. If you say, oh, I am tired, I am weak, I am broke, I am unhappy, those carry the I, God particle. Those carry that God power. So you've got to be, so never use it as a de to, to, to decrease yourself, to make yourself smaller. Use it to build on what you truly are. Remember, if you say I am wealthy, I am healthy, I am happy, you are not making this up. That's who you are. The real you, the real self is all that and more because that's, the, that's God. So if you can believe that, then when you say it, you can believe it. So use it to affirm what you desire. That's what you want to use the I am for. Consciously start using it, right? The only truth is the I am, or God, or unconditional awareness. That's the pure truth. That's the pure reality. You determine what's true for you through the use of that I am. You condition that unconditioned awareness. Yes, you condition that God awareness into what you want to be. So no, there is nothing, there are no limits to that. It's belief and feeling is the, is the secret to that. Dare to assume your highest concept always with that I am. That's the best use of the oldest confirmation before time was, right? If you can imagine it, then it's true. So you, you, you could say, well, I'm wealthy, but that's not true. It is true. If you can imagine it's true, if you can dare to assume it, if you can dare to imagine in your imagination, imagine what would your friends say to you as the new you, as the wealthy you, as the healthy you. Imagine those conversations. Walk in that confidence. Ignore your senses and, and use your imagination for that. Imagine from the end, as, as Neville Goddard would say, right? Assume your wish fulfilled. Assume that you are that. The physical world, the whole big physical world, as big as you think it is, is just an effect. So stop working trying to change effects and responding to effects and go into the imagination. That is where the seed of everything. Everything is an idea. That's where everything comes from, right? That infinite matrix of information that we call God, that zero point field, right? That is, that is even where there is not even energy registered. That is the God consciousness. That's where energy comes from. That's where matter comes from. That's where everything comes from. That's your creative ability. That's, you've got a direct line to that as I am. I am is God, is your I am awareness. So claim your desire to be reality now. Don't, don't claim it as someday in the future or it will stay in the future, right? Don't look at others and say, well, they, they, they had an advantage. No, we all have this power. 
They are drawing those things to them because they are, they are that I am awareness. That's their heart's desire. We're all individual creators. We all are, there's enough for everybody and we can keep on creating. So this is the good news, guys. It doesn't matter what has happened in the past. Each moment is new. Each moment is now. The only thing that keeps you in the past is your thoughts in your past. That's what, that's what your thoughts and emotions keep you tied to the past and keep creating it. But you don't have to stay there. You don't have to be there. You're not obligated. No one, we're all that, we're all in that God consciousness and it's all happening right now. Get into the arena, guys, and start creating. Have fun with it. Remember, it's all a dream anyway. Where this is all created. This is all, this is the other world, right? There's, a, there's another world beyond this. There's that God consciousness, right? There's a veil. So enjoy yourself while you're here. Unequaled when you use this I am affirmation, guys. I am strong. I am healthy. I am, I am wealthy. Yes, I am intelligent. I am successful. This is the affirmation you want to use and you want to mean it and you want to do it with feeling and then go into your imagination and what, what would you be doing as that? What would they be saying to you? Create an event. Create the conversation. Create the feeling. Right? Maybe it's a phone call. Maybe it's a visit from a friend. Maybe it's you getting on a plane and you feel yourself walking up the stairs. You know you're going to, you're flying around the world. Envision it. Imagine it. It's yours. It's yours and it's done. Yeah? That's what I got for today, guys. This is Tom Karen with the Be Something Wonderful studio of Higher Consciousness, where we help you level up and become the best version of yourself. Don't forget to subscribe, uh, hit the notification button, and, and like and share the videos and comment. That's how we get our message out. Yeah, this is Tom. Until next time, with Be Something Wonderful, see you soon.